Hello guys, in this video I am going to introduce you to Brev. Brev makes it easier to fine tune, train or deploy your models. Brev brings new difference to hold this large language model fine tuning and training. Brev was created by this guy Nadir Khalil and his co-founder Alec and the story behind Brev is quite interesting. Let me give you a bit of a background. Nader and his co-founder Alec, they created Brev in 2020 as a humble attempt to make it easier to use cloud infrastructure because people were spinning up GPU powered EC2 instances and then getting the shocker of their life. Before that, Alec and Nader had built two companies, one failed and one was acquired. Every time they found success, they stopped talking to users and building them, building for them because of all their bandwidth was sucked into scaling their cloud infrastructure. In an attempt to make the simplest cloud infrastructure tool, AI ML developer, developers discovered them about two years ago in summer of 2022. To build an open source model, you have to use cloud resources, but this comes with a lot of friction in provisioning, in availability, and especially in surprising cloud builds. And that really becomes the use case for both of these founders. And that is how they built Brev from their first principle. And then sort of Brev 2 was launched in October. This Brev 2 has credits for super transparent billing. It has more NVIDIA A100 GPUs available. And you know that that is like a gold these days and also too many stability upgrades to count as in another's own world. Now, there are a lot of good things about this uh, new launch as the main purpose is to make it better tool by tailoring it for the AI ML use cases. They have also built a tool called as Verb, which they have felt was the right abstraction for reliability and pedantically installing CUDA and Python versions, plus a UI that makes it easy to use. You can just pick the Python version or CUDA version from a drop down on Brev and it installs. That's it. If you have seen my videos, I sometimes even struggle to install CUDA on different drivers on different sort of systems. So that is, this is really like a blessing so that we can focus on a model training, fine tuning and inference instead of just battling with these CUDA versions and drivers. They have also rebuilt the instance creation page to make it a much more simple GPU provisioning tool. And they also built relationships with data centers directly to get more A100 supply. I don't know how they have done it, but that's a real good feat. Now they have seen 355% user growth and it continued to climb. They have also <coughs> uh, scaled it, make it more resilient. And this new version is really cool. Let me give you a quick rundown of it. If you want to... Um, use it try it out then simply go to this website and i'll drop the link to it in video's description once you are there it is brev.dev then click on get started sign in with your account and also verify your phone number and once you f verify your phone number you will be presented to this screen and let me make it a bit bigger okay now on this screen you can see that you need to specify your use case I'm just going to go with inference. They want to talk to the model. And then how did you hear about Brev? Okay, so I just got it from Twitter or X. Then click on enter. I am praying that he's not going to ask me uh, for credit card. I hope that Nader and Alec are generous enough to let me try. Okay, seems like they are. Let's see. Okay, so there are a few blueprints. You can see that you can deploy a replicate model on Brev.dev or you can fine tune Llama 2 or you can generate the images with this automatic triple uh, one, uh, quadruple one and stable diffusion. But let me spin up my new instance. So I'm just clicking on new. And okay, I think it is going to ask me money because it's not cheap. But anyway, let's go with it. Let's see what happens. So I'm just going to go with 80. 80 gig GPU memory. How about a smaller one? 41. Okay, so this one. And then running rate is this. You can just give it any name. 
and then you can see that it is on GCP it seems Google Cloud and it is costing me around $8 per hour and 40 GB, GB memory is quite huge okay if you want to save money you can go with spot instance but that won't um, really guarantee that it will be available it could be turned out on a short notice and if I click on deploy then let's see what happens so it is asking me add credits to spin up your instance okay so it is asking me custom zero okay now they need twenty dollar or more so next so it seems I need to edit my credit card so now that if you're watching it give me some token or credit so that I could at least try it out anyway unfortunately can't do it but no problem let's go back and check out few other things like if you want to see GPUs just go from here let's stay with GPU so they have a100 810g t4v so if you don't know what this tvph means I have a detailed video where I go into the generation of GPUs like H is for I guess Hopper and V for Volta and it goes on and on and A for Ampere I guess okay and then you can just click on instances to see which instances are there if you want to fine tune Llama you can just click on it and then you get this notebook from there it has step by step instruction as how to fine tune it how cool is that and I have various other videos where I describe in detail how to do the fine tuning let me click on back and then notebooks we already have seen I'm not sure what people is okay so I can add more of team members and I can generate invite link and then last but not least you can have docs to go through it awesome so that's it guys this was just a quick short overview um, I think pretty good tool um, I wish they would give some credits initially maybe you know 10 20 dollars to try them out but I understand GPUs are expensive and it is not software uh, so I understand where it have, wherever GPUs in this day and age are concerned it makes sense M mid, but maybe if I get my hands on any credit I might show you some working demo from Brev but having said that if you are looking for a specific dedicated platform for fine tuning or training your LLMs where the cost is transparent and you exactly know how much it is going to cost then I think give this Brava a try sounds cool let me know what do you think in the comments if you know about any other similar tool let me know and i'll be happy to review it and if you like the content then please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching